a planet scarred by fire and upheaval. For years, ash darkened the skies, a mourning veil for the age of the Titans. Slowly, the planet cooled, the fires of war hardened into the crust beneath our feet. Deep fractures became mythic prisons, Tartarus, carved by the earth itself. As pressure built beneath the land, new mountains rose, interpreted as the Olympians' ascension. Lightning tore the heavens again, but this time it was not war, it was rebirth. From cooled lava flowed fertile soil. Life began where death had ruled. Nature reclaimed the battlefield, forests rising from titan bones. To ancient eyes, these shapes were sleeping titans, petrified under the earth. Where the ground still boiled, legends of monsters were born, children of the defeated age. The scars of Titanomachy align with real tectonic fractures still active today. As land collapsed, the sea poured in, creating the first deep basins of the Aegean. Explosive eruptions birthed new lands, islands the Greeks credited to divine architects. Stability returned. Lightning no longer punished the earth, it ruled over it. The world reshaped by catastrophe became the realm of new gods. And from the ash plains, humans emerged, witnesses to a world still trembling with divine memory. Traumatized by quakes and eruptions, our ancestors forged myths to explain the Earth's fury. Modern geology reveals the truth behind their tales. Myth was their science. Every layer of rock is a page of a forgotten war. Written in magma,